Hey guys, it's me, Coffee, in an actual game. Oh my god, the lag is insane. Uh, besides the lag, uh, if you guys don't mind, could y'all tell me, uh, before this video starts, could y'all tell me any ideas in the comments? Because I want to do what y'all want to see, so yeah. Thank you, and uh, enjoy the video. Okay, boys, so today we are playing TDS, but only using event towers and support, so like bomb, etc. Because it's kind of hard to do without fun because someone's going to be placing it. Yes, I am using Commando and Frost Blaster because I own them. And uh, yeah, let's just get into the video. Okay, so I started the early game off with farming because some of these towers can get at the pricey, like I just said. And I wanted to be able to have a lot of towers since some of these event towers do not have a lot of DPS. And the loadout I brought was a uh, Commander Toxic on a slider bomb frost blaster and for early defense we had about two gladiators my teammates also used warden and cowboy since that is technically an event tower because it does come from an event so yeah saying as you will it's not limited but it may be i don't really know what they can do with it but yeah okay so let's get to the good part the first tower i placed after i bombed for like a million rounds was a frost blaster yes so the first thing i did is upgrade it twice so we can have a bit more stuff and they got a cool pair of gloves and a visor, which was pretty sick. Then I leveled up some more and got max bombs on 24 cents. I was bringing a lot of DPS to us, like Commando and Toxic on them. So I was buffing and bringing some important DPS, which Commando could have, I think, like 44 DPS, which is pretty decent, not for its cost, but for an event tower, yeah. And then I maxed out my Frost Blaster and went to place my Commando, which was the Pirate Commando skin because I think it looks sick. And yeah, I placed my Commando down. In a pretty bad spot, if I'm being honest, because it really couldn't hit anything, but it was still pretty fine. Then I also leveled up him instantly to level 4, which he got a sick hat, parrot, and some cannon launchers. The quad cannon, which is very, very powerful. And yeah, he started actually doing some very good damage and helping us out a ton. Because we didn't have any mini gunners or any of that. So our real DPS was just gladiators and cowboys. The next thing I decided to place was Sludgers for the Freeze ability because my Frostbuster wasn't really as far up as I wanted and it would freeze and help out a lot because their damage was good and I definitely needed some freezing capabilities so I could stay alive because some bigger bosses would have stopped coming and I didn't want the game because the uh, base. Sorry, I'm so good. I, I also placed a Toxic Earth so basically what that does is slow down the enemy so they're getting slowed and freezed which was very very powerful. So for most of the other ways, I just added a lot more DPS. Like it's in like I'm still speaking probably seven or five times. I just added a ton of DPS with commandos because they were probably the highest DPS tower I had in that game. Because Frostbuster isn't really known for its uh, amazing DPS to be honest. And uh, yeah, so let's probably skip to some more important important rounds. Okay, so sorry that I did mess up with the warden warden because I'm a bit dumb. But now we're on round 40 as you can see, and the multi bosses come out. This is the molten boss, if you didn't know, that's what he looks like, pretty scary. So, uh, yeah, and also the, with the, uh, blasty, the rockets that came out of the, uh, <laughs> commando, basically, they did this really cool pattern, and it looks sick, but I'll stop talking so you guys can watch and see what happens. Okay, so we did win, which I was expecting to win, but definitely tell me what you guys want to see next, maybe different videos, anything, just tell me in the comments below, because I'll probably use your idea, not because I'm out of ideas, but I kind of do want to see what you guys want to see for next time, see you guys later, and uh, thank you for all watching, have an amazing, wonderful day, see you guys next time.